Mark Wright is here! Yay! How are you doing, guys? Morning, Mark. How are you? Morning. I'm very good. How are you two? Yeah, really good. But more importantly, Mark, can you do early mornings? Um, I didn't think I could, but I actually feel all right. I think this all the dancing is getting me fit. And the stamina. <laughs> I bet ready, you're you know? bouncing out of bed, aren't you? <laughs> yeah, bouncing, doing a few <laughs> twirls and jumping in the shower. Brushing his teeth, yeah, <laughs> yeah. exactly. Like toothbrush on, yeah, doing the samba. <laughs> <laughs> now, to, for me, I heard you saying that you never had a spray tan, even though you live in the capital of Orange. Okay, so, so basically, I have never ever, not just a spray tan, I have never used fake tan. So no when, way. No, never. And then now, strictly started, you get a tan by like the producer every week do you want to tan and massage this week uh, or physio and I'm always like no and everyone else has a spray tan and I have started to look on the telly and think actually I look a bit white but I want to stick to my guns and not have one so no. when I talk to people like you two and you ask me I can be honest and say I haven't you know stick to your guns and the good news is because most of the time you're on the radio doing club classics on a Friday and Saturday night obviously you're not doing it on a Saturday at the moment uh, for obvious uh, reasons so for those who've not actually heard your stonking tunes <laughs> Oh, I love them. Stonking tunes on a Friday and Saturday. Tell us about Club Classics, Mark. Um, Club Classics, I'll play everything. Um, the, you know, party floor fillers. This, this week, actually, on Strictly, I'm dancing to one of my Club Classics. That's no the way. way I like oh, it. Oh, Yeah. Does Nanny Keeping Pat tune in, uh, Mark? Um, <laughs> Nanny Pat loves the Club Classics. <laughs> Do you Go practice on. any of your dance moves on Nanny Pat? <laughs> No, I don't. <laughs> Why would Swirl you do that? around the living room. Why you've got I'm to not practice when pick he gets Nanny, at home? I'm not going to pick Nanny Pop in a Foxtrot American smooth <laughs> and swing around my head. <laughs> Your nerves really get the better of you, don't they, sometimes when you're on the show. How does it feel now? Are you getting better? Are you coping a bit better? Because I think those judges can be really hard on you. I can't describe what them nerves are like. Like, if it was 5% more, I reckon I wouldn't be able to go out there. It's, really? It's, genuinely horrendous um but the, no they're not getting better if, if, if i'm going to be honest they're not yet I, I, i've been told they will but i've not hit that stage you, yet now you said that you don't want michelle and your mum and dad in the audience because they make you worse have you re- is that true have you really stopped them from going no they, they make me emotional not nervous it's oh. weird like because i'm so worked up and so nervous and so tense that the next route is kind of to cry. <laughs> well, I tell you something. I think you're ace. You're you're oh, so good, Mark. I mean, so even much. when you're dressed like this, the Superman music <laughs> is standing there. You look over to Michelle, give her a cheeky little wink, <laughs> and then cry. reveal the super right is up there. It was so good. I mean, I know you sort of like say that wasn't your best performance for uh, Superman, but uh, are you feeling like more confident now that when you do go out with the, with the training? Yeah, I mean, I'm not the best dancer. I'm naturally not a good mover. Um, so I just need to go out there and smile. I thought and your fun. caterpillar was brilliant. Yeah, I love the caterpillar. The judges <laughs> didn't know. I thought it was ace. Well, good <laughs> luck with it on uh, Saturday. Final question in one word: Who's going to win? Uh, I think Jake from EastEnders is going to win. He, he is, is good. really good. But so's uh, Frankie. She's very good as well. Yeah, Fr- Frankie or Jake, definitely one of them too. Well, okay. so guys, you need to vote because. I can't be in that bottom two again. No, you won't be. You can't be. You've got to get through. Um, Mark, just before we go, we're going to play a little game with you, testing out your, uh, your dance knowledge. It's simply called, Is It a Dance or Just Something from <laughs> France? Right. Are you ready for this game? Basically, yeah. what we're going to do is we're going to um, say a word, and you've got to say whether it's something to do with dance, a dance move, or just something random from France. Let's do it. Here's number one. A part of Shah. France. Is it a... No. <laughs> it's no? a dance move. It's the step of the cat. No, oh, okay. Never heard of this. Uh, Arc de Triomphe. France. <laughs> it's the right answer. Woo! What about a changement? Dance. Yes! Well done. Uh, next one. What about a hoochie coochie? Dance. <laughs> it is. It's a, it's a cheeky little belly dance. How have you got that? Twingo. Da- dance. It's got to be, isn't it? No, it's from Renault. It's a Renault from France. <laughs> uh, what about this? Uh, Petit déjeuner. France. Yes, it's a small breakfast. What? I like it's a small <laughs> breakfast. Why is it a small breakfast? Petty. Um, well, développé. Mm. Dance. Yeah, it's unfolding of the leg. Mark Wright. Well done. Not only are you good at dance, but you're good at France as well. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you so much for coming on and joining us this morning. Best of luck for the weekend we'll as well. We'll be voting for you. Don't let Mark Wright be in that bottom two and we'll vote for him this weekend. Mark Wright, thank you very much. Thank Good you luck. so much, guys. See you later. Bye-bye. Bye. Bye-bye. Bye.